Well, Chris and Izzy, they have a number of things in place. They've been working on a lot of those logistics behind the scenes. As you can see behind me, prep work is underway right out here in front of Globe Life Field. And in less than 24 hours, the calmness you see here will turn into a massive celebration. It's a moment we've waited more than 50 years for. Texas Rangers are now World Series champions. The team clinching the title over the Arizona Diamondbacks on the road, and now it's time to bring the celebrations home. We are very excited to be hosting our first parade ever here in Arlington. The victory parade is scheduled for tomorrow at 1215 through the city's entertainment district. It's free of charge and so is parking and lots around the route. You're going to want to get out here early, not only for a good view, but to avoid the inevitable congestion. Arlington PD spokesperson Tim Siesco says is going to come from thousands coming out to celebrate. We are expecting a very, very, very large crowd. The way it's kind of been put to me, imagine having two Cowboys games and three or four Rangers games going on at the same time. The parade will travel just under a two mile route clockwise around Globe Life Field and Choctaw Stadium. Expect it to last about an hour. It starts on Cowboys Way near Lot A on the southwest corner of Globe Life before turning right at AT&T Way and Road to Six Flags, then finishing off on Stadium Drive. The Rangers say restrooms and concessions will be open in Choctaw Stadium on the west and south sides during the festivities, with safety a top priority for the historic event. So we'll have hundreds of Arlington police officers out there. We've also requested assistance from some of our surrounding agencies. We really want to thank Grand Prairie PD, Texas DPS and the Tarrant County Sheriff's Office for agreeing to send some folks out to help assist us. And if you need an excuse note to get time off to go to the parade, Arlington Mayor Jim Ross has got you covered. The city tweeted out this official letter for anyone who may need it. And the work going on here outside of Globe Life is for the post parade celebration. We're, we'll hear from Rangers executives. Of course, we'll hear from the players and it's going to be hosted by Rangers Hall of Famer Chuck Morgan. And it is just going to be such a good time, Chris. 